This is a clip from Pondering Spooky Tape 73 Gan. Check the description for the full episode. Is there no Megan jump scare? No. There's not no. a single jump scare yet, which, I mean, hey, to be honest, that's that's better than an actual jump scare. She could have screamed and, like, her face opens up and you see the robot part, robot parts under it. Oh, just like the Atomic Heart robots. Oh, I was thinking uh, of the FNAF robot. There's one that does that. No, one's spring trap. <laughs> that's, no, one Springtrap? No, Springtrap's a big rabbit. It doesn't open. This is more of the, the Garden of Ban Ban of doll movies. <laughs> I take that back. Shut the f*** <laughs> up. You need to take Oh. That, that is fine. I do, I do take that so back. Mean. That is so mean. I, w I was just being mean because I played Garden of Ban Ban two days ago and I'm so pissed what off about it. Did <laughs> why, did you, why did you play why? it? Why did you play completely uh, uh, like heavily subdivided model imported the, directly from Blender? Dimitri was there, right? No, <laughs> no, he wasn't game. because... What the f***? I had, um, I had tested, like, I've been doing tests in another game. There's this thing in a poster that, lo that looked like Ban Ban. It turned out it wasn't Ban Ban. It turned out it was Jumbo Josh or something. And I went, huh. Well, oh, I wonder what it's like at the end of this, like, Five Nights at Freddy's Human Centipede. Because it's, I was like, what's, a month ago, I'm like, what's Garden of Ban Ban? It's like, oh, it's a Poppy Playtime ripoff. I didn't know what Poppy yeah. Playtime was. I'm oh, like, oh, dude. this is a, oh, no. I found out what that was. I'm like, oh, it's free. Okay. Garden of Ban Ban is a seven minute game and I've never wanted to refund something so strongly that I played for free. Yeah, I, I wish I no, could buy it, it on it was, like a key reseller site. I, I'm really <laughs> okay. I, just, I, I need to know what the fuck were you talking about by you saw it on a poster? Oh no, like I was I was like testing a different game and like there was um there was a poster in it and there was a thing I'm like, oh that kind of looks like that looks like what I thought was Ban Ban, a, a, a stupid green thing. Oh, I'm like, oh, I'm like okay, what is? It? Like, oh, that okay. looks like that one like Ban Ban thing. Okay, I got confused. So I, I was because I, I this gets more deranged. You said. Because I thought I was like, <sighs> Brendan knows Callisto Protocol had like the PUBG connection, and for like a psychotic moment, you I was like, you is, thought does this have a Ban Ban? Connection? Yes, I thought it had does a Ban Ban connection. A ban -ban connection? <laughs> yes. Oh, I shit. didn't know shit about Garden of oh Ban Ban. I'm like, God. is this a huge thing? Like, is this possible? Most, tell me about Ban Ban. Tell me about Ban Ban. One of the ban. most fucked up things I've ever heard is the Ban Ban connection. Oh, shit. We're finally playing the Ban Ban protocol. This is insane. Oh, yeah. So God. I was like, let me see what Ban Ban's about. Oh, cool. It's free. And then I... I deeply regretted every second <laughs> playing that game. So anyway, grief-stricken child attacks the town. Uh, yeah. Grief. <laughs> <laughs> was it... I, I, f <laughs> I <laughs> was <laughs> sure. I, I guess this episode is going to be a grief stricken child attacking the well, town. For the, I'm curious for the, uh, the section where they had the commercial for like the Furbies, the perpetual yeah. pets. Was that, do you know if that was like done by an outsourced little group? Like the, so I feel like it could have been the like people who you did the cheddar goblin what? and Mandy. Or like the uh, oh, I I don't know like what, too many cooks. What it remind what it reminded me of it was um because th this is a Blumhouse movie and Blumhouse made another um they they had like a Hulu show called Into the Dark I think. Are you talking about Puka? I, it's fucked up that you know exactly what I was gonna say. <laughs> it's, it's it is so fucked up that you know that I was gonna say Puka because I have a I Puka is a big part. Puka is a daily part of my life. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm so Puka. What? I mean, amen, bro. But like, it, no, no, if, absolutely if you, fucking not, amen. What? <laughs> if you don't, if you don't know Puka, it's like this big fucking Furby thing that's like, but it's like a, it's more like a mascot, but it looks like a big oh, Furby. Yeah, it, it, there's this um. They okay, so there's an anthology series that Blumhouse made that was from their series called Into the Dark. And Puka is like the most famous out of all of those. And it's like a still not it's, great. It's like a, it, oh, it's it not good. Is not, it is not at all. But Puka is a rabbit? I don't know what the it's, fuck it's a it is. It's Puka. It's a weird it's, critter. It's, a, it's like a, a weird critter and the movie, the, the short film happens during like Christmas time and the dude is like losing his fucking shit about Yeah, he, he dresses up as Puka for yeah. his job and then he thinks like Puka's stalking him. It's, yeah, he, he's it's nothing like, remarkable. Puka's gonna kill me. It, it's really, it's the it's a Blumhouse like short film. It's well, not great. 
The reason Puka is a daily part of my life now is because there was a sequel, which I had some friends over. We were getting really Whoa, fucking drunk. Wh- wh- what? Yeah, there's a sequel. It's called Puka. Oh, Puka Lives. Puka, I was looking it yeah, up. Puka it's a full lives. movie. Yeah, Puka Lives. It's a whole Shut movie. Shut the fuck up. <gasps> what? I cannot believe they made an actual movie out of Puka. Yeah, but there's um, it's really interesting. Well, not the movie, but the interesting part is Felicia Day <laughs> showed up. And her what? character, her character's like really like she's like perfect and knows exactly what's gonna happen. And she's like the she's it's like a self insert character. I'm like this is really weird. Like why is she like this? And then at the end, it's an executive produced by Felicia Day. And I went, uh, oh, that's the most interesting part of the movie. That is really interesting. What the fuck? Also, I'm looking at Puka lives. Why does why did they yassify Puka? Because oh, they definitely did. Shit movie. Puka looks like a Fortnite skin in Dude, that. I'm looking at it. And yeah, it no, yeah. looks like a that Fortnite skin. That is not skin. the po- That is not hashtag not my Puka. I remember Puka being a fat, weird creature Furby thing. No, it's a, it's a one slur Furby now. It's so weird. It's like a fucking. It's like a fursuit you'd see at a fucking furry convention. Can't wait to get yeah. off the Blumhouse battle bus. The only the only reason that's relevant is because my girlfriend saw the. Uh, opening credits and she passed out instantly and as soon as the ending credits rolled she, she woke asleep. up and she said she I just had a puka nap and the term puka <laughs> and the term puka nap will not fucking leave my vocabulary oh my god okay. I would say that fuck yeah. oh sorry I- I'll censor that it doesn't sorry. matter okay you can censor it just make it puka wouldn't say that <laughs> <laughs>